Now, obviously, the big battle right now is uh -huh. the big beef between the game and Meek Mill. Right. So at this point, the game drops 92 bars mm -hmm. on wax. Mm -hmm. Meek responds with the ooh mm -hmm. instrumental mm -hmm. featuring O'Melly, his label mate, on mm -hmm. Dream Chasers and Beanie Siegel on the feature. Mm -hmm. And then earlier today, uh, the game dropped mm -hmm. another freestyle, mm -hmm. um, this time on the ooh instrumental as well. Mm -hmm. um, just, of course, there's stuff behind the the wax and the music that's going on as well. Yeah. Instagrams back and forth, a lot of pointing fingers yeah. back and forth. Mm -hmm. But just as far as the wax battle, right. what's your current take weighing in on the situation? First of all, like we said, man, God bless they keep it on wax, keep it cordial. We don't need no more, you know, violence amongst each other, man, um, you know, physically. Now, lyrically, this this battle is fire between the both of them. Um, two two high energy dudes, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Um, you know, both talk both talk that shit, man, you know what I mean? And and the way I look at it, like, game dropped 92 bars first, Meek replied with the ooh, then game dropped ooh. I'm impressed with both of them so far, like just going back at it, you know what I mean? Um, when 92 bars first dropped, I was like, I was like fire. When ooh, when Meek dropped ooh, I was like fire. But this was the thing. I felt like both might have, both weren't attacking each other through the whole track. And 92 bars, if you listen, 30 is probably not for Meek. You get what I'm saying? Maybe 40, maybe 50, not for Meek, really. On Meek Ooh joint, his, like, the, the first verse that he spit, most of it wasn't even, it was just about, you know, his life. You know, he talked that shit. Wasn't really for game, really. You get what I'm saying? And I know he previewed it, some of it on another, on a snippet before or whatever um, that he did or whatever. So... I felt like both joints is fire. I salute both of them, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I listen to Meek when I go to the gym all day. Like, that's my... He got, like, the best workout music. Get me so goddamn hype and shit. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I fuck with Meek all day. And I've been fucking with Game and his lyricism. Like, I always thought Game was a fucking monster with the bars. Like, I always thought that. And with the first two diss tracks, I felt they both not attacking each other fully. You get what I'm saying? And plus the homie O'Melly jumped on and Seagull, so it looked like they jumped game, which is all right, as long as it's fire. It's all right. You get what I'm saying? Now, game returns with ooh by himself going five minutes blacking out. I would love, just as an MC and know how, how fire Meek is and knowing the potential Meek really got when it comes to this diss shit, you get what I'm saying? Because he's a battle rapper in his, in his blood. I would love to hear Meek go back at him right now on his own. Like, yo, chill, I got it, I got it. And then just go off. And then we just, you know, call, and then leave it. And then from there, just leave it. You get what I'm saying? Like, game just emptied a five-minute clip, like, going straight at him. If Meek come back and empty a clip going that game, let the people judge from there and just leave it alone, man. If they can squash it and solve it, solve it, and just leave it from there. I can't say who winning. I don't really, you know, really get into that, and it's hard to judge. Like I said, when you got both diss tracks the first time, not fully getting at the person. I know this one with Game Drop, ooh, all the way, everything was directed towards Meek in this camp. So I love to see Meek come back, you know what I'm saying? And um, Meek, ooh, joint, got game hype. See, you could tell. You could tell when Meek dropped, ooh, it hit game. And, I, and game probably the type of nigga like, yeah, nigga, that's what I was waiting for type shit. You know what I'm saying? Just like when game dropped his shit, you could tell Meek. Because when Meek was going at it with Drake, you ain't hear Meek this hype. If you listen to Meek on ooh, ooh, Meek sound happy. Like, yeah, this was the type of war I've been waiting for to go back at it with, a, you know, two street niggas going at it. I, that's probably what he'd been waiting for. So as a fan of hip hop, I would, I would love to hear Meek return back one more shot since game just shot. I would love to hear Meek return his now. And then, with, you know, people could judge it, but just leave it at that.